Welcome to SEC Second Look on AL.com. It is a huge weekend in the SEC involving both the teams in the state of Alabama. The Crimson Tide hosting Mississippi State, number one Bulldogs. Let's talk about keys to victory. Let's start with Mississippi State visiting Alabama, Mike. Well, I think the weakness for this Mississippi State team throughout the year has been their secondary. Uh, they've shown occasions where they've played well. A lot of the yards against them have come in garbage time, but they have given up a lot of yardage. I think the key to them to winning this game is keeping Amari Cooper from beating them, uh, particularly over the top. They're going to have to limit him and limit the big plays from the Alabama offense to have a chance this, in this game. I think. What about Alabama? Has played very well at home this year. Now the Bulldogs are number one coming to town. I think Alabama, it kind of plays into a strength of theirs. Is they're going to have to stop that Mississippi State running game, particularly Dak Prescott taking off and running the ball. And the way he's able to create uh, creates opportunities for Josh Robinson, the second, uh, second leading rusher in the SEC. I think Alabama puts a clamps on those two defensively. That gives them a good chance to win the game. In Athens, Georgia, Auburn comes to visit. Uh, devastating loss last week to Texas A&M. How do they get back on track? Key to victory for the Tigers. I think the key to victory for Auburn is the key to victory just about every week, and that's them being able to establish the run, uh, run the football, and stop the run. Uh, you know, if they run for a lot of yards like they did last year on this Georgia defense, which I think is they're capable of doing, they might be able to name their number, and I think that's the key for them this week. Georgia's been as hot and, as hot and cold as any team in the country this year. What are their keys to beating Auburn? I think their key is the same. They've got to run the football. I've not seen Hudson Mason beat a team through the air by himself this year. When they've been successful, it's because that running game is working. So much like Auburn, I think their key this week is being able to run the football on that Auburn defensive front. Uh, Todd Gurley coming back. If he and Nick Chubb can control the football, they'll have a good chance to win. Four teams with still SEC championship aspirations, obviously in Tuscaloosa State and Alabama, still very much in the national championship picture. 